future. Jonathan Swift once said, Falsehood flies and the truth comes limping after it. And I think we can all agree, what a smart thing to say. Common knowledge is full of such falsehoods. Misconceptions can be handed down through the ages and circulated throughout culture until everyone holds them as concrete fact. For example, that Michael Bay sure knows how to make a movie. I'm Adam from whatculture.com and here are 10 false facts you probably believe. Number 10, bulls are enraged by red. Like a red rag to a bull goes the expression and if common knowledge just to be believed when bulls aren't f***ing up china shops or being grabbed by the horns, they get mondo pissed off by the colour red. Except, nope. Cattle have dichromatic vision, meaning they see the world in shades of blues, yellows and greys. Red is just another variation of one of those colours. In fact, Mythbusters tried waving red, blue and white flags at bulls. The reactions were all the same as in they couldn't give less of a bull crap until it was waved at them when they charged. It's not the colour of the flag being waved that provokes the bull, rather the act of waving itself. Number nine, lightning never strikes the same place twice. Another fact that's been retained by society by virtue of it being a popular metaphor, lightning doesn't strike the same place twice, except Nope. Lightning frequently strikes the same place twice, which is what a lot of people rely on when they put conductors on top of tall buildings like the Empire State, the Eiffel Tower, the CN Tower. They get struck by lightning 50 to 100 times a year, which is a good thing because it means the lightning doesn't go other places nearby, like, I don't know, onto your dock. Number eight, lemmings commit mass suicide. This video game has a lot to answer for. Do most people even know what actual lemmings look like? Here's one. Four, I would. Common knowledge has it that lemmings literally throw themselves to their deaths over cliffs in act of mass suicide, except Nope. This misconception arises because lemmings, like most rodents, have huge population booms, then they outgrow their habitat, and then they have to migrate en masse, splitting up, scattering in large groups in search of better places to live. So suddenly a huge amount of lemmings disappears overnight, but not over a cliff. Number seven, hair and fingernails continue to grow after death. The human body is an awful thing, a jumbling mass of bile and rubbery bits held together in a spotty skin bag. Well, it doesn't get any cuddlier after you die, so they say, because not only do they steal your body away and replace it with a spooky skeleton, but your hair and nails continue to grow after death, except Nope. Both hair and nails need glucose to grow, and that supply ceases immediately on death. Instead, the illusion of hair and nails growing is created by the skin tightening and retracting around them as it becomes dehydrated and everyone gets gaunt and god isn't life a relentless parade of sunshine. Number six, eating before swimming leads to cramps and drowning. One of the oldest cautionary tales there is, if you eat and swim, you'll drown. Except, nope. There's vague rationale at play with this theory. The act of digestion diverts blood flow from the limbs and muscles which could lead to cramping in significant cases. Thing is, you need to be swimming at Olympic level after having consumed a banquet to actually run a risk of your limbs seizing up. Less than 1% of drownings occur after people have eaten. Number five, daddy long legs are incredibly venomous to humans. Daddy long legs are the worst f***ing creatures in the world. F*** them. I'll say it again. Daddy long legs. Horrible air scuttlers flying all up in your face when you're trying to watch your Simpsons. I hate them. F*** off. Also, they're the most poisonous spiders in the world. Except, nope, because that would make them interesting when they're not. They're f***ing When we say daddy long legs, we commonly refer to two different creatures. One's a spider, one isn't. The one that isn't doesn't have venom glands, so that's out. The spider one can bite, can produce venom, but it's barely poisonous at all. And even when it can attack the flesh, which its jaws are often too weak to do, it's more of a mild skin irritant than anything else, because they're a waste of my f***ing life. Piss off, Daddy Long Legs, you're a mistake. Number four, you get arthritis from cracking your knuckles. Except, nope, you won't at all. Cracking knuckles is brilliant fun. It feels good and sounds awesome. For ages, people thought that little pops of gas from bubbles building up in your joints and eased out by pressure would cause arthritis, i.e. inflammation in said joints. There's theoretical talk from a purely engineering standpoint about, you know, repeated knuckle cracking may be damaging cartilage, but there's zero scientific data to back that up. In fact, one Californian doctor spent 60 years cracking the knuckles in just his left hand as an experiment, and 60 years on, not a trace of arthritis in either hand. Number three, goldfish have terrible memories. The myth goes that goldfish have terrible memories and it's the foundation of all sorts of jokes that your dad thinks are great and he laughs to himself and you just look at him and pour yourself another drink and promise to never be that way. Goldfish memories are three to seven seconds, right? Except... Nope. A researcher from Sydney's Macquarie University found that based on more than a decade of observation, Goldie can retain environmental information such as colours, shapes and sounds for over a year. So that's about 5 million times longer than previously thought. So what's your excuse now, Dory? Number two, bats are blind. 
bats, those things that are always uglier than you remember them being. Oh, what the hell is that thing? Anyway, despite bats looking like your nan in the morning, they're pretty cool. They hunt, they shriek, and they're the inspiration for one of the greatest superheroes of all time, Lego Batman. And they managed to do it all while being blind. Except... Nope, bats aren't even a little bit blind. In fact, they can see up to three times better than humans. Because they do a lot of hunting in darkness and live in caves, etc., people assume that they were blind. But in actual fact, their echolocation skills are basically just a bonus on top of already stellar natural eyesight. Bats are the best, and they look the worst. And number one, Everest is the tallest mountain on Earth. This one's gotta be true, right? Everest is the tallest mountain on Earth, right? It has to be, except... Nope. Okay, now, maybe this one's splitting hairs, but it's interesting, so shush. Everest has the highest altitude of any mountain. Sure, it's 8,850 metres above sea level, which is goddamn loads of metres. But in terms of actual height, from base of the mountain to summit of the mountain, the tallest is actually Mauna Kea in Hawaii. It measures 10,100 metres and has a volume of 3,200 kilometres cubed, which is almost four times bigger than your mum. It doesn't get its dues, though, because 60% of that mass is below sea level. And that's our list. Did we miss any out? Tell us about it in the comments. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. You can follow me on Twitter here. I'm Adam from whatculture.com and I'll see you soon.